Honduran t-shirts have been reorganizing after the government announced a monthly $35 increase in the t-shirts overall salary after seven years with no raise. Teachers are upset over the minimal raise, but the education secretary says that there is no money for greater salary increases because the budget has been used to improve school infrastructure. The teachers have responded that this isn't true and that this low increase is another of several attacks that they have received from the authorities. We've been defeated again. We have to accept that. The struggle of 2011 left us very weak. There is a tremendous abuse against the teachers movement. We've had 40 colleagues assassinated since the 2009 coup d'etat and our organizations are in very bad shape. The education secretary's argument that they have spent the money on infrastructure is questionable considering the current conditions of elementary and middle schools. In many cases, students don't have a place to sit. The teachers are upset over the low salary raise. The salary increase is very low. We expected a bigger raise. 800 lempiras or $35 won't help us with anything. The education secretary is pressing us to improve, but in return we don't receive any benefit. Teachers organizations in Honduras are trying to use the negative reaction to the wage increase in order to build momentum to reorganize what until 2011 was the country's most important social movement. Violence and abuse dissolve the teachers organizations, which are looking to make a comeback and fight for their rights. Gerardo Torres, Telesur, Honduras.